All right, guys, welcome back. Um, today, what I want to share with you is my uh, Ravel 1957 Chevy two-door post kit. Um, I was so glad that they came out with the two-door posts because for years, all we had was the uh, hardtop. And um, so I, I couldn't wait to build one of these. Uh, this one I built as a uh, late 50s, early 60s, um, mild custom. As you can see, I, I uh, removed the uh, Bel Air script and, and fin down the side. Just leaving that single uh, chrome strip there. Shaved the door handles. Did my uh, normal 57 Chevy, shaved the bullets. Um, yeah, it's a really nice kit. I've only built, I think, one of these. And uh, I don't know why I haven't built any more. I also added a, a visor to it. And I made a set of skirts for it. Yeah, it's a really cool looking uh, 57 Chevy. I wanted a white interior. And luckily for me, it came with a white plastic interior. So I didn't paint it. But I did add the, uh, the decals for the... Um, interior on the inside sort of a brown or not brown but a black uh, houndstooth um, pattern on it added a couple of uh, speaker covers some green carpet on the back package tray and on the inside can't really see in there though added a couple of uh, Appleton dummy spot lamps to give it that uh, late 50s very early 60s cruiser type look the uh, color on it is uh, black with a green pearl and I don't know if you can I'm trying to see if I can pick some some of that color up even though I've got two uh, lights on this thing right now the uh, color is so dark that it, it just looks like a black car through the uh, telephone screen that I'm looking through but, um, yeah, that's my uh, Revell 57 Chevy, two-door post, 60s custom. What I've also got for you today is a couple of shop card uh, call-outs. I got Ron Stewart here. Ron Stewart was nice enough to uh, send me one of his shop cards. Um, he's a really nice guy. If, if you get a chance, go over there and check out his, um, his site. He's... From day one, he's always um, commented on my uh, channel. He's a really nice guy, and I'm very happy to have his card. Ron, thank you so much. Um, second card I also got is from Sodak Model Cars. Um, this guy, I, I call him Soda. He probably wonders why I call him Soda and not Sodak, but... Um, it's just an easy nickname for me to remember when I think of his channel. He does really cool work, as does Ron. You know, they do both do bitch and work. Look at that Merc in the uh, 32 on there. That's, you know, some of Ron's builds. Sodak, he also does awesome builds. He does really good paint work. Um, he was nice enough to send me this little sticker. I wish I'd known the guys were having stickers made because... Um, I would have had some done too, and I think I still will, but, um, if you get a chance, go check out Sodak Model Cars, and, uh, give him a like and a subscribe, and leave him a comment, same thing with Ron, go over there and check him out, and leave, give him a like and a comment, please, and, um, tell him that I, uh, sent you guys, and, uh, if you like this kind of stuff, leave me a like and a comment, and uh, subscribe if you haven't, and definitely um, share it with your buddies. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next one.